Hey everyone, Adam here and I am back with a brand new reaction for the channel. So this is a reaction first time to Calandra and the song The Waiting Game. Now this was requested to me from the company who filmed the latest Vardruna music video. Now obviously you know you could see the skill and talent of these guys. They're called Ragnarok Film. They con contacted me on my Instagram and they said they also did work on the music video for this song. So if you haven't seen my latest reaction to Vardruna, make sure you go and check that out as well because the music video for that is stunning. So I've already seen, you know, their guys work on there. So I am really, really excited to hear it and see what they're going to do with this. I've never heard of Calandra before. This is brand new for my channel. So it will be really interesting to hear this. So here we go. This is Calandra and The Waiting Game. Thank you. 
Hmm. It looks like the rest is credits. Wow. Oh, wow, that was super, super interesting. So what I really liked about this, um, I mean, I've never heard Calandra before. I'm guessing uh, she's just a solo artist um, singer. I mean, I don't know if Calandra is like part of a band or if it's just her, but really, really enjoyed the song. Um, it reminded me so much of Aurora. You know, the, I, I could hear Aurora's voice on this so easily. It sounds very much like something that she could sing and sing so damn well. Vocally, she did have quite a similar kind of sound to Aurora as well in certain places, especially during the chorus. But I really, really enjoyed this Calandra. This was brilliant. Um, for an artist or band who I've never heard of before, I am so here for this. I loved just that gentle nature of the song as it kind of like, you know, trudged on and on. Um, I love that big build of music that kind of sounds for you that kind of played towards the end of the song as well. I love that. I love when bands take a moment to just let the music kind of speak you know when when the vocal stops and you know that sound just allows itself to really breathe um snow patrol pipe quite popular for doing that um in some of their songs and there are other artists who do it really really well and i love that you know calandra took the time to do that there it was beautiful her voice as well is so soft and subtle but it's gorgeous it's got such a directness to it where it draws you in and you have to listen to every single word it complemented the music in this so beautifully. You know, in the lyrics talking about the waiting game, about two people kind of waiting for each other. Um, so very interesting. It's almost a conversation that isn't happening because you're too busy waiting for each other in whatever type of relationship it may be. So, so interesting concept. I really, really liked that. Can we talk about this music video as well, please? Was that all done in one take? Because that was phenomenal. Don't think I saw the camera cut once. That is such a level of skill. You know, when you, you look at films like Children of Men is a classic where there, there's that scene in the car which the camera doesn't cut for so long. Um, you know, there's so many different films out there. 1917, the whole film looks like it's been done in one take. You know, and it's incredible. And this is, you know, falls in line with that level of skill. You know, the fact that this looked like it was all rehearsed and all done in one take is incredible. And in Ragnarok film, you guys, you know, you just... You just knock it out of the park every time with your work and you've done it again here. This was brilliant. I kind of feel like this is a movie that I want to watch more about. I want to find out, you know, more about this girl. I want to find out more about this guy. Why they're chasing each other down. I feel like you got a little bit of a hint towards that at the end where, you know, she'd obviously killed him. And then his essence, his soul had come out. And then she had that moment of having almost his soul, his life force in her hand. And then she put it back into him knowing that it would bring him back to life and then the game starts again you know where she's been chased again by him so does this mean is this an ongoing game between them are they lovers um you know there was a moment of affection at the end there um but it looks like an ongoing game how long has it been go going on for you know and if he manages to get her and kill her does he do the same thing to her um is this just a chapter of their lives together you know there's so many un unanswered questions i kind of feel like i want a part two to this or i want a, a prequel to learn more about it. it's such a fascinating concept um but i loved as well you know it was all filmed in the snow i'm guessing i'm, I'm only guessing maybe filmed in norway again but the scenery was beautiful that lovely white backdrop as well it's stunning you know it kind of gives that essence of is it, you know, a kind of a heavenly backdrop? Because obviously it does deal with death in this. It's so many, so interesting, so many questions that are left unanswered, damn it, and I want to know more. <laughs> but yes, I want to say a special thank you to Ragnarok Film for you guys for suggesting this. I really, really enjoyed this. And Calandra, they're going straight on my soundtrack, like on my car playlist. I can't wait to listen to more by them. But yes, thank you again for suggesting this. Your guys' work is incredible. And if you have any more suggestions, you know what to do please leave them in the comments down below. As you know, I read every single comment. I respond to as many as I possibly can. And I always appreciate when you guys take the time to comment. Um, are there any big Calandra fans out there or is this new to you? Please leave me comments down below as well if you have any more suggestions by Calandra. And by all means, I will definitely be back to listen to more by this artist because I am loving what I've heard so far. Uh, if you like the video, please give it a thumbs up and please come and subscribe to my channel if you don't already. Um, honestly, the number just keeps going up and up of subscribers. We're over 17,000 now and that is incredible. And that is all down to you. So thank you all of you subscribers out there who take the time to press that subscribe button. It really does mean the world to me. And I love to see when you guys come over in the comments, those, you know, 
people come back again and again to leave comments and leave really positive, lovely, welcoming comments. And I really do appreciate that. So thank you everybody who takes the time to do that. And if you don't subscribe, make sure you hit that subscribe button. It's the fastest way to get new notifications as to when a new video like this drops. All of my social media channels are just up here in the corner. This is my Twitter and my Instagram, so please come and give me a follow on those channels as well. And if you're not in the Discord and you want to chat more about the channel, about songs that you enjoy, about the artists that I re react to, please jump in the Discord down below. There's two links in there. There's Strawn's Hangout, which has all of the kind of usual suspects of people that I react to, you know, kind of your Angelina Jordan, your Aurora, your Dimash. Um, your Morissette, all you know, all the different regulars, they're all got their own channels down there. But also, you know, if you want to just jump in and just talk about music that you enjoy, if you want to make direct requests to me, if you want to just share and get amongst it and talk to each other about the music that you like and maybe a favorite song you've been listening to, anything like that, make sure you jump in and join the conversation in there. And we also have the metal one as well. So the metal hangout is just down below as well. So if you're into your metal music and you want to talk about metal music in there, um, you want to make metal suggestions to me, anything like that. Both Discords have a really warm and welcoming community and you're always more than welcome to jump in there and to join the conversation. So again, thank you for suggesting this Ragnarok Films. This has been incredible and I cannot wait to hear more by Calandra. But until next time, take care.